Welcome to the Water Cycle VR experience. Take a look around to discover how water moves from the Earth into the atmosphere, and back again. If you are viewing this in VR, interact with content by focusing your attention on the object. For 360 users, simply click to interact. The water cycle describes how water evaporates from the surface of the Earth, and rises into the atmosphere. Here it cools and condenses in clouds, and falls again to the Earth's surface as precipitation. The cycle is a closed system. This means that the amount of water in the cycle is always the same. But the availability of water varies across the globe. This cycle begins with the sun. Interact with the sun to hear about its role in the cycle. The energy of the sun drives the water cycle. Heat, from the sun causes water to evaporate, into the atmosphere. Find where evaporation is occurring in this scene to continue your learning. Evaporation is the process of water changing from a liquid to a gas. This gas is called water vapor. Evaporation allows water to escape from the Earth's surface into the atmosphere. Look for the cloud in the sky for the next step, in the water cycle. As water vapor rises into the atmosphere, it cools, and condenses. People can see this in the form of clouds. Condensation is therefore the process of water changing from a gas back to a liquid. Now, look for the rain cloud to explore the next step in the cycle. Rainfall is also known as precipitation. Precipitation occurs when the atmosphere becomes saturated with water vapor. Under these conditions, the water condenses and becomes too heavy to remain in the atmosphere. It falls back to earth as rain or snow. The amount of precipitation that falls, is different between places around the world. Now, look for the water running off the surface of the land. Water remains stored in oceans, lakes, rivers, dams, ponds or under the ground until the cycle begins again. When you have finished exploring this scene, you can either start the scene again, by looking down to find the back button or find a summary of the information from this scene in the man's backpack. Water that reaches the Earth's surface from precipitation, moves across the surface of the Earth, as runoff. Hard surfaces, such as roads and rocks, will increase the speed of runoff. Water that does not run off the land, infiltrates into the soil, where it finds its way into groundwater. This process is called infiltration. 